Hey guys, it's your better class guy here once again. Welcome back to my channel. Alright, so we finally had it just about over the weekend or Friday night. We had a couple of Democrats just finally fucking come out and straight up admit it. They don't give a fuck if it's proven that Donald Trump, President Trump, didn't break any laws whatsoever. They're going to try to fucking impeach him if they get the lead in the House in Congress. Okay, so why is this important? It brings back the fact that I've been saying for a while. They don't fucking care. They have no idea how, what the rule of constitution of the Constitution is. They have no uh, real idea of the articles and uh, how to draw up impeachment or whatever. Impeachment. Under the clause, you must be the person, whether it be Senate, Congressman, or even the fucking President, must be a uh, accused of fucking accepting bribery. Well, we look at Hillary Clinton. We already know she's been bribed. You didn't impeach her ass. You can't bribe her. No proof that he's done that. Uh, treason. Again, no proof he's ever fucking done that. He ain't done it. Uh, and the third, high fucking crimes uh, um, against the state. None of that. He doesn't fucking mean any of it. These investigations mean fucking nothing. They can't prove he colluded with Russia, which again, is not a fucking high high crime. Why? Because we're not at war with fucking Russia. We don't have an embargo. We do not war with in Russia. It's not fucking treason. Paying off people... With campaign funds, if he fucking did it. Number one, it is not technically legal if he fucking did it. And if so, it's an FCC uh, via fucking relation. Again, not a high fucking crime. It's a fucking fine. But it's not a high fucking crime. They can't impeach him on it. Um, granted, you need a semi-majority in Congress to pass. But you need a supermajority in the fucking Senate. Which is where the trial would be and all that. You need a super two-thirds majority in the Senate. And you ain't gonna fucking get it. Okay? They don't fucking care about how the economy's fucking going. They don't give a shit about fucking you or me. Whether you be Democrat or Republican, they don't give a fuck about you. They care about their fucking money and their power. Granted, right is the same fucking way. But, they don't fucking, they fucking admit it. They don't give a fuck if you're found by fucking guilty by Mueller or not. Even if Mueller says he's totally fucking innocent, they're going to try and fucking feature his ass. Again, manipulating the Constitution. Most of those fuckers in Washington don't need to fucking be there because they don't know the Constitution. Some do. Rand Paul fucking does. Fuck Paul Ryan. Paul Ryan don't know shit. Just like, um, you know, McCain, he didn't know fucking thing. John McCain, he's he done going up with him. I did a video on him. Go see it. But see, this proves they don't fucking care. Don't give a fuck if they wreck your fucking economy. Don't give a fuck if they wreck. Well, all they want to do is go in and impeach and raise. Rescind the tax cuts. Take your fuck money and raise taxes on all of you. Don't listen to their bullshit about raising another 1%. It's going to go on every fucking body. They're going to fucking tax their high fucking friends. They're not going to tax their, tax their big buddies and fucking um, businesses that are putting money into their fucking pockets. They're not going to tax their good buddies in fucking Hollywood. They're going to tax their good buddies in the fucking media. You're fucking stupid if you think they are. Jesus. And don't give a... I don't see how anyone wants to fucking vote Democrat, at least nationally, any fucking more. How can you want to? And I'm not fucking saying that you don't have to vote Republican. You have to go vote Republican. Become an independent voter like me. I am I'm independent. I do my research. That's your job as a fucking voter. You know, yeah, we get the power to vote, but at least make your fucking be, make your vote smart. Go out, be an independent, go vote fucking Green Party. God, don't vote socialist, goddamn, get out of the wet, that shit, too. Democrats are fucking nuts. They don't give a fuck about you. If any of the Democrats in Congress gave one fucking eye about you, they would have all, some of them would have voted for the fucking tax set. No, fucking one of them did it. Give a fuck about that tells you right there they didn't give a shit about you. So they don't give a fuck about this trade deal they just got today. They don't give a fuck about anything. This they don't give a fuck that this investigation is a fucking sham. Because that fucking Hillary Clinton off, there's a shit ton of fucking evidence against her. They're letting all of her fucking people go with immunity. Oh, we can't find nothing. Bullshit. Oh, and the one thing they did find, they let him go because, uh, what's her name, Abba, Abba Aberdeen's uh, tech guy, they let him go because he threatened if they prosecuted him, he'd reveal a whole bunch of information on at least 40 Democrats on um, uh, tax fraud. 
and money uh, fund manipulation, which would get go in jail time. It can senators and Congress uh, men and women. And probably had some Republicans too. Let me wrong. I, I believe they were probably them too. Oh, cut him a fucking immunity deal. Yeah, they, that's fucking green assault. Yeah. Thank God I ain't the fucking Attorney General. I go, no, but you can tell me. I won't cut you. I'll cut you Jeff and give me the information all them fucking senators and congressmen who are, are illegally doing tax funds. I'll do that. But yeah, that's fucking bullshit. Again, they're admitting it. They don't fucking care anymore. They just want to impeach him. Even on no fucking grounds. Okay? Again, working against the Constitution. Now, let's say what happens if they do get the majority. That looks like they're going to get the Senate. The fact they're going to probably lose a couple seats. Oh, that's right. Uh, Trump's approval polls are at 46%. Some have a 48%. Some have a 44%. I'm going, and quite a few have a 46 I'm going to go with that one. It's right in the middle. Um, he's, he's high up in fucking Republicans. His, his uh, numbers are going up with independents. His numbers are going up with uh, blacks and Hispanics all across the nation. Um, I believe um, if they may if they if the Republicans may Republicans may narrowly keep the Congress or they may lose it by a couple of seats depends because Congress is harder to determine because it's by district um, you can get some liberal leaning districts where you're at and not everyone is back in the president which is a fucking mistake you can get back to fucking president if you expect to win so that's just a bunch of fucking bullshit so what happens if they do take it <clears throat> excuse me I'm making a lot of videos today. Um, let's say they do take it. They go to impeachment. Okay, and they pass the impeachment. Well, they ain't throwing him out of office. He goes, got to go to the Senate for that. You got to get a super majority. Well, you ain't going to fucking have one. You know the fucking writers. Do you really think that if that went to the fucking Senate, and if you want to go up, up to them with this bullshit that you got, which you ain't got fucking nothing, and they're going by the law, um, do you really think that they're going to fucking vote your move from office? Number one, you get Pence. Going into office, and them too. All the Republicans there know their fucking house would burn to the fucking ground from up, from everyone getting pissed off from the vote him out of office. Ain't gonna fucking happen. So now what have you done? So the Republicans, uh, excuse me, the Democrats will just hold shit in the Senate uh, and, and bog shit down, trying to get shit repealed, which won't fucking happen because the Senate would stop being so the president. So for two years, you're going to negate shit again. Then come 2020, all Trump has to do. And everyone who's got to be replaced in Congress by Democrat wise, I'll just get to look. All they've been doing is obstructing, trying to take your shit. And I've been doing all this shit. Before these guys got in the house, the economy was going great. I was getting trade deals. I was getting all this. You were making fucking money hand over fist on the stock market and your paycheck. This, that, and the other. These guys want to come fuck it all up. And he'll fucking win on that in 2020. I fucking guarantee you, I don't give a fuck who you put up against him in 2020 as a Democrat. They will fucking lose. He will beat the fuck out of every Democrat with that, along with any Republicans who are smart enough to fucking follow him. And they will beat the fuck out of each Democrat, and they'll fucking not only lose the House, they'll fucking lose the Senate, and probably go down in fucking flames, with the exception of maybe California and fucking New York. Maybe Illinois. So yeah, that's fucking stupid. They finally fucking admitted that's what they're going to do. Yeah, I've been trying to tell you guys this for for fucking months, weeks. So yeah, so there's a little t bit of news for you. Glad I could pass it on. Pass this fucking video on to everyone, cause yeah, the Democrats are fucking stupid. Don't vote for Democrat. Go vote fucking Independent Green Party if you don't want to vote for a Republican. I understand that. Just God damn, don't be fucking stupid. Jesus Christ, I've never. I've never been so mad at a political party in my whole fucking time in my life of doing politics. Okay. This is just fucking stupid. All right, what do you guys think? Go down below, like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, you guys take care. And I'll see you all next time.